Summer is coming to an end as NDSU students are making their way back to campus. Although it's an exciting time for students, it's important to be aware of potential dangers. A study says women ages 18 to 24 are at a higher risk of sexual violence. Valley News Team's Kelly Hubbard spoke with families to see what precautions their students are taking. It'll bring me to yeah. my classes. Yeah. Olivia Holmberg and Cassidy Rushlow are looking at their soon-to-be fall classes, two of the many moving into their college dorm Saturday. Saying goodbye to mom and dad and starting a seemingly scary phase. I'm nervous as like going out on my own, like I don't have my parents anymore, I don't really know anybody. Over 11% of students experience rape or sexual assault through force or violence. And among undergrads, 23% of females and 5% of males have been raped or sexually assaulted. They say 50% of college sexual assaults that happen on campus happen in the beginning of the school year. That's the months of August to November. NDSU police says that the targets are fresh Everybody is learning um, new things, they're getting to know new people, so they want to get involved and then they might make more risky behaviors just because they want to be accepted and make those friends. It still scares me that we anyone could get assaulted anywhere, anytime. We, I think we just have to keep it in the back of our mind and always be aware that it is a possibility, even though we might think that it's not going to be us, it could always, it might be you. Many fathers like Steve Gostad giving their daughters some last words of wisdom. Every campus has that out, those opportunities. College kids are college kids. Sometimes they don't make the best decisions. He says to travel in groups and to not find yourself alone at night. In Fargo, Callie Hubbard, Valley News Live. NDSU has a self-defense class that you can take at their school. For more information, visit our website. That's valleynewslive.com.